everyone today is the day i moved back to uni yay i'm literally so excited it's currently half eight in the morning i am leaving at half ten and i have not packed this is what i'm dealing with you guys know me i hate packing i will literally pack at the very last second like you will not catch me packing a week before even though i tell myself like yeah i'm gonna do some packing today it just never happens and like my voice is going a bit i don't know what's wrong with me i'm just all over the place and then this is what i'm also dealing with so all of this i have to sort out and put in my suitcase and then do like toiletries and stuff and it's half eight and i'm fucking knackered but you know we're moving back to uni today and I'm very excited. I am excited to go back. I'm a bit apprehensive just because I've been away for so long. Um, I feel so like distant from it, if that makes sense. But no, it's definitely time to go back. So I'm gonna pack this. This is the small pile I have accumulated already. I mean, if you can call that small, I don't really know. And then I've gotta go through this and then pack all my makeup. Oh. You know what, I'm just sat here, I'm like, why did I not just do this yesterday? Why didn't I do this yesterday? Also, this mirror, do you remember when I made this mirror in quarantine, lockdown one? It used to be like really nice, like cream. It's now like yellow. I came home and I'm like, that is yellow. Look at it. That is a yellow mirror. I don't even use this mirror anymore, so I kind of want to get rid of it, but it doesn't matter because I'm not here. And then this is what I'm wearing. Oh, dirty man. Um, This new Nikki Studios hoodie came yesterday, so I'm wearing that. And if you have an eagle eye, you have noticed that I've taken out my hair extensions and short hair is back. Just because I was like, Dad took them out. And then I was like, why am I going to put them back in? Because like, I'm not going out anywhere. I'm literally going to be sat in my uni room doing online lectures. Like, they are a chore. So, like, why am I going to have this chore if I'm not even, like, going out and... Like, looking, do you know what I mean? Like, so I was like, I can't be out of them. So I took them out and I cut my hair. And I'm kind of loving it. Wait until I have to cut it and then I'll probably be really angry at myself, but whatever. Right, I should probably stop chatting and start packing. Okay, I understand this might look like a bit of a mess, but I'm getting there. So this is all the floor stuff. And then over here, I've done my toiletries, shoes, and like like underwear and like la like gym wear sort of bits but now i'm gonna go through this i don't know if i need i don't know how many hoodies i need i don't really need a lot this is the dilemma like, this is the dilemma i have i have a lot of like going out sort of clothes like blazers and heels which i don't know if to bring up with me because like i don't know when i'm gonna actually be allowed to like go out again so like is there any point bringing up like a leather blazer because i probably won't wear it because then if lockdown is over and i can come back then i can pick up all my going out clothes so that is what i'm struggling that's my look at that that's why i shoot my depop i have so many cute like new house of cb bit bits I might just bring like one or two, just in case. <gasps> I don't know, but I'm like nervous. Like I feel nervous, I don't know why. Oof, we've got an hour to go. An hour to go, or if I don't, if I'm not packed in time, Angie's gonna kill me. So I should probably finish this off. I know what I need to do. I need to go and get all my coats from downstairs because I have, too many coats and i don't know which ones to bring i don't think i'll be ready for an hour sorry but i'm gonna take this white hoodie that will go straight in my suitcase i'm literally the best right now oh. i don't know why i'm crying because like i've made the decision to move back up there like it is for the best part I just get upset, I'm like packing all my stuff. I've been here for so long. I've literally been here for like, start in December, so that's a whole, it's about a month and a half, like two months I've been here. That's literally flowing by, like what the hell. But it's fine, I just get myself worked up, I can do it. I've done it before, I'll do it again. Anyway, so I, this bad boy is all packed up and ready, and I've had to move on to my smaller one, which again, 
I've already filled so I think I'm bringing up too much stuff but the benefit of that is I'll bring it up, I'll unpack with mum, and then anything that I don't need, I can just put it back in the suitcase and mum can just bring it home. So, it's not, I don't, I'd rather get up there and be like, oh, I don't need this, than get up there and be like, fuck, I forgot this. Do you know what I mean? So, that's my mentality with packing. God, the sun is so bright, but we have now all packed the car up. Look at this, it is literally full to the brim. But we are on our way. My lovely mother is taking me today. And I'm very excited because she hasn't even seen where I live. Because dad took me up the first time. Like she hasn't seen my uni room. I haven't met my flatmates, have you? No. So I'm very excited. Um, and then we're gonna go to Sainsbury's, get some food for my flat. I need to do some laundry. changed I'm wearing my new Nikki Studios tracksuit which I'm in love with and I've got my new trainers on which I'll show you which I haven't actually shown you yet so I'll show you when we oh actually I'll just show you now these are my new babies I mean look how pretty they are they're the grey track trainers um, and I just thought why not you know I haven't got a pair of grey trainers so they'd be a great investment piece that was my logic. Anyway, we've been driving for about 40 minutes and we've really got about an hour and 20 left, I think. An hour and 25, so it's not too bad, is it? No. I'm very excited to go back. It comes in waves of excitement and then, now I'm on the road, I feel a lot better. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It comes in waves. Okay, we've got about 40 minutes left haven't we yeah i don't actually know where we are whereabouts are we i think we're just coming out of stoke coming out of stoke if anyone lives in stoke we're very close to you in 1.8 miles yeah fourth exit yeah m6 to the northwest m6 yeah to the northwest fourth exit i'm mum's little navigator this morning hey look feels like we're doing another drive with me this lighting is shocking. You're all making me very hungry because I keep tapping through my tagged Instagram stories and everyone's making baked oats this morning. And I didn't make mine this morning because I was busy packing and mum had already packed up the Ninja Bullet. So you're all making me very jealous. Do you like my baked oats? I've never had it. I have to make it for you on a bag. But I got a DM the other day and someone asked to um, if I could make white chocolate and raspberry baked toast Ooh. which I think would be nice yes. would I put fresh raspberries in or frozen raspberries just a matter just a matter so maybe one day next week um I'll try I'll try that and I'll vlog it for you all hi <laughs> I don't think anyone's in oh my god look at all their fucking parcels <laughs> Jesus and they left the hoover outside my room <laughs> we love that Thanks guys! And we're back! Woo! This is my room. She hasn't even seen it yet. Oh, I've missed this room. Oh, there we go. God, I've got so many parcels. What the hell? God, how many glossy boxes? Jesus Christ. <laughs> Look, do you like it? Yeah. And then this is my bed. And then this is my bathroom. Look. Oh, lovely. It's my bathroom. You haven't seen it? No. Ooh, there it's you go. on the floor down there. Oh, I spilled bleach. Mm. It's my bathroom. Ooh. You happy with it? Yeah. Oh, I've still got some it's cotton nice, wool. And, but we are back. Oh, I just need to make my bed. And we need, we've left like my suitcase and like all the other bags downstairs Let's because we can't them. carry them, on, honestly, because I live two floors up so it's fucking no lift, you know. Oh, come but on. We're strong women. She's washing me. Okay, so we've just whacked my laundry on. That will take 40 minutes. And now we're going to go to Sainsbury's just to get some food. Not a lot, just like 
provisions just to get me through like the next couple of days. Um, I just need like stuff to make my baked oats and then a dinner. Maybe get some salmon or something, I don't really know. See what they've got in. Um, but it's so sunny and it feels like good to be back but then I don't want you to go home mm -hmm. and leave me. Like, I kind of wish I could just come back with you again and just leave my stuff here. Okay, we are back from Sainsbury's um, and I'll give you a full haul when we're in the kitchen but this is a little sneak peek of what we bought which mum kindly bought for me which was very nice of her. We've just bought some sandwiches and some lunch and we're gonna eat it and then she's gonna leave me. And <laughs> I think I'll cry. Is that a towel? Uh, they're all in the wall. All of them? Yeah. Oh, for goodness sake. You can uh, dry your hat. Oh God. There'll be a tea towel in the kitchen. <gasps> she just wiped her hands on my throw. What uh, do you think of my room anyway? Because you haven't been in it. What's your first impressions of it? Lovely, I think it's lovely. Very, very spacious and yeah, very nice. Mum's just left me. Now she's had to go home because she didn't want to drive in the dark because it just freaks her out, which I understand. Um, it's about like half three and I've got a seminar at four and I need to go get my laundry from the laundry room but I'm not gonna have a seminar today so I kind of want to do that and then I'll go and get my laundry um I don't know how I feel like, I'm just doubting myself I'm like is this exactly what you want like are you sure you want to come back because I'm not gonna lie like as much as I love being back here I love vlogging I love my flatmates it's just it gets lonely from time to time and like being back at home for two months like you're never lonely and like you're never on your own and I'm just like now I have to get back I have to get used to that again oh always hard when mum leaves it's always hard when someone has to leave I was like this with dad and chill when they left and they dropped me off oh. I got so much unpacking to do oh I literally can't be bothered literally can't be bothered I need to like wash my hair tonight as well It'll be fine. I'll be fine. We're gonna have. I don't know what we're gonna get tonight, but I think we're gonna have. Like, we're gonna get a take. We're gonna get some takeout, get some delivery, and have a nice night. Um. I don't really know. I really don't know. Oh, I don't know. Mum was like, "Come back with me." <laughs> she was literally just like, "Come back with me, and I'll take you again next week." And I was like, "No, no, don't be silly. I have to stay. I'm staying." It'd be fine, I've done it before, I can do it again. Oh, it's just, I just wish it wasn't locked down. I'd be completely fine if it wasn't locked down, but I just, I don't even know if it's gonna get eased on the 22nd. I really don't know, but if it wasn't locked down, I'd be completely fine. But then I've done a lockdown here in November, and like, that was fine. It wasn't fine, it was tough, but I mean, it was all right. Anyway, I'm gonna stop feeling sorry for myself and I'm just gonna, I've had a cry, I had a cry with my mum in the car, but I feel like I can't keep crying because I literally was seven, seven out of four, which I still need to do a little bit of the reading for. So I'm gonna finish that, do the seven art, and then I'll get back to you at about five o'clock because um, I need to unpack, make my bed, and things like that. So I'm back officially. I'm back and I'm, I'm sad but happy about it. I was so excited in the car but now I've got here and she's dropped me off. Just feels like in September all over again when they first dropped me off. It literally just feels like that. And it has that weird uni smell. It has that weird uni smell, I don't even know. Anyway. Anyway, I'm gonna go. I might persuade Alicia to come get a Starbucks with me later. Just fancy one. Just fancy a hot chocolate. All right, bye. Okay, I finished my seminar and it, to be fair, it wasn't actually too bad. So that was an hour. It's now about five o'clock um, and I need to unpack my shopping because I was stupid and didn't, and like forgot to do it when mum was here. And now I just looked down, I was like, shit, my shopping. So I need to unpack that. So that has not been in the fridge. But I don't think I bought like any meat or anything. But I bought like milk. So that needs to go in the fridge ASAP. Have you all missed my kitchen? And um, the girls left it 
not in the best state. I won't show you the sink, um, but they're both out at the moment and they're on their way back. So they can tidy that up because it's not my mess. Anyway, let me do a haul. Sainsbury's haul. I didn't buy like all my meals for the week because like, I was with mum. And I was just like, mum like, wanted to leave quite soon because she wanted to get back when it was light. So I was like, I'm not going to buy loads. And also, like, I, hadn't, I, didn't, I don't know what I want to eat. Okay, I've just given the fridge a bit of a clean. And then this is my drawer here, which I've cleaned. And I've cleaned all the back of there. Well, not all. I didn't get those bits, but you know what I mean. So this is what I bought. So eggs. Um, these are the best bagels you will ever eat because I do like bagels but I find that they're too thick even when I cut them in half I find them too stodgy and these are perfect so I love these I got some grapes what the fuck is that oh some lettuce some bananas uh, some raisins and then I just got a yogurt a beauty blender what else is in it some tomatoes some halloumi and then some risotto because i made it the other night and it was fucking amazing so i'm gonna make another one quite soon then in here i've got my pea snap duh got two bags of them mushrooms with the risotto and then i got what else is in here oh my god i bought these i bought some like crispy tofu because basically I'll put you back up here basically you know the like tiktok pizza wrap trend i saw someone do it and they put like lettuce tomato the crispy tofu and then like some like sort of like mayonnaise um and it looked amazing and i always find that chicken i don't i'm not a big fan of chicken in it so i got some to tofu which I've tried tofu before, but these look really good. They look like chicken nuggets. So I'm going to try them. I know it's not veganuary anymore, but I mean, like, there's always... If you do plant-based options, you know it's great. I think the thing is falling off it. Whatever. Okay. What else did I buy? Oh, of course, I had to get some rolled oats for my baked oats, obviously. And then I got some wraps to do that trend with because i do love it my favorite is you know my m s sauce that i use if i use that as a base and then put cheddar cheese on top and then i put well like mozzarella shredded cheese put that in the oven for like eight minutes take it out and it's like a pizza and then i got a little milk because you know just for like cups of teas i don't really drink a lot of milk um and I was gonna go get like a big Oatly Barista one, but it's just too big. I won't drink it all, it's just a waste. And then I did buy some chicken if I want it in like bagels and stuff. Um, oh yeah, this is the packaging. The Tofu Company, crispy, it looked really good. Um, and then I had a Nando's the other day and I ate this sauce, the Nando's Perinés, peri peri mayonnaise, and it was amazing. So I'm thinking, I put chicken and a bit of this maybe like in a bagel some lettuce could be nice for lunch and then i just got like a coke which i was supposed to drink earlier which i haven't um so yeah not a lot not a lot of like meals but i'll plan on my meals tonight and then go back when i can be asked but i think we're just getting a takeaway tonight so i didn't really have to plan we're back hello how are you Good. How are you? Well, we were united about a couple hours ago, but we've just been having a catch up. Yeah. Um, I long time no see. Stick on nails on. Mm -hmm. And we've just been gossiping. Yeah, lovely. Catching, catching up. Catch up. Um. Anyway, we have got Nando's because I've never been a Nando's girl, but I had it the other night, and it's just like kick-started something in me. I just really enjoyed it. So. I love the Nando's. We're getting the Nando's. Um, I, love the Nando's. I need some plates. Did someone break my pink bottle? No. Oh, I have it. No, no, no. Mm, I think I might have it. Because I had two and there's only one. I think I might have it in my room. I've basically just stolen all of Lydia's. Um, <laughs> I used the one glasses as well. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I've just stolen all of Lydia's plates, bowls, 
glasses. They're all and right we, now. Oh my god, you should see this. You've seen the baked oats in my story. Yeah. I keep looking at them like they look nice, but do I want to put them like you know like a roasting tin? Yeah. So I bought one and that's pink, and then I bought a little one for my baked oats that's also pink. How cute! Mm, and then cool. I bought some knives, some pastel colour knives. That's cute, isn't it? That is cute. Thank okay, you. You have to make it for me and put me on because I will not make that for myself. I'll make, I'll make one for you. I will. Okay. And maybe it will convince me to wake up earlier. Because it is, it just like, is like cake. Honestly, you'll love it. Hmm. You'll love it, guys. Do you want to catch up or anything? Um, garlic sauce, please. I actually want to try this. I haven't tried it. Really? Okay, uh, everyone. And I'm going to try, I'm going to have this, the Pyrenees mayonnaise. Yay! Yay! We've not I'm hungry, daddy, I'm hungry. I'm literally so hungry. I've missed vlog. Have you? They've missed you. I got so many DMs today when I said I was coming back to the you. Like, you need vlogs. Yeah, I was yeah. like, yeah, yeah. We should do a flat night, like, come down with me. Yeah. How much fun would that be? Can we? Each person is separate in the kitchen. Yeah. This is my meal. Yes, I got veg because I'm being like a healthy queen, whatever. Can never be me. Um, and then this is what Alicia's eating. And this is the kitchen, guys. Just give you another little look. Okay, stop. It's blurring. What? No, but what's happening? Yeah. It's all right. And then I've got a little Coke as my drink. And then these are my nails. I literally just picked them up in Sainsbury's. Yeah, they're from Sainsbury's. Yeah. Oh my god, they're literally not going to focus on my hand. Mm -mm. But they're really cute. Oh, you can't even see them, but they're like French tip. 